Two of last Wednesday's victims were from the town of Winthrop, and tonight that community came together for a candlelight vigil to pay tribute to a father and son. New Center Maine's Ann Baldrich has that story. This night is about remembrance and a chance for the community to come together and begin the healing process. Aaron Young was a freshman here at Winthrop High School. Aaron and his father Bill were part of a bowling league at Just In Time, one of the sites of the awful tragedy that happened just one week ago tonight. Aaron's mom, Bill's wife, was here tonight along with Aaron's two half-sisters. This vigil looks a little different than the traditional ones we've seen. The family has asked some of the school to incorporate some of their favorite things, songs, classic Chevy trucks, and there were cards on display that were written by students here at the school. We had a chance to speak with Bill's sisters who came in town to be here. Felt better than I thought it was going to feel, to be honest. It just, like, to see, like I said, to see the community wrap my sister-in-law and my niece in love just, it just shows that there's, you know, there is good. There is good in the midst of all of this, in the midst of all the, the sadness and the, the terror that happened a week ago. There's, there's a lot of good, too. In addition to tonight, there have been therapy dogs on school property all week long to help students cope with the loss of their fellow classmate, Aaron Young. In Winthrop and Baldridge, New Center.